Uh, welcome to this video about open domain problems and the ABC which um, here would like to um, yeah, explain you the idea of the absorbing boundary conditions. Um, the absorbing boundary conditions uh, aim to construct the boundary condition such that the waves that the waves can only pass in one direction. So if waves approaching this boundary condition then the waves traveling in the their respective direction like here in the positive x direction are, will pass and waves which are traveling the other direction will be reflected and this is done by the here the characteristics of the waves which are traveling in positive x direction uh, it's also known from the from the Sommerfeld radiation condition here and this is uh, more or less how it works so we can introduce on the gradient of the pressure in the normal direction it can be modeled by this time derivative of the acoustic pressure and this is how we then get the absorbing boundary condition into 3D model of our finite element simulation um, yeah doing further mathematics we saw before that this this expression must yield zero and we have now a wave which is traveling positive x direction which already does this based on the wave and the characteristics of the wave uh, we see that doing some math this is zero so these waves will pass uh, the characteristic set on the boundary and these will waves will uh, be going through the boundary without any reflections. Having now a wave traveling in the negative x direction uh, which is more or less modeled by this, this wave packet up there. Inserting it here we will see that this doesn't yield zero so these waves will be reflected which means that the green wave traveling in positive direction will pass this interface um, waves traveling in the negative direction of the x of x will be reflected at this interface and this is what we would like to show and already have and by setting this characteristic on the boundary condition we can satisfy this and this is the ABC um, extending this ABC to 3D we just more or less say replace the X by the derivative or the gradient in the normal direction of the boundary uh, which is modeled by this minus 1 over C um, times the time derivative of the acoustic pressure. This is ideal if the wave impinges orthogonal on the boundary and then it works perfectly. So if we would have a, a domain which satisfied that all the waves impinge normal on the boundaries then this type of ABC would work perfectly. Um, we can incorporate it, it into the weak formulation as I said before it's similar done as incorporating an inhomogeneous Neumann boundary condition here we would simply set um, the right hand side of the ABC here in the normal uh, gradient of the acoustic pressure on the boundary and that's more or less it. Then we obtain a semi-discrete Kalerkin form where we have some additional damping term due to the boundaries and this damping coefficient matrix is simply an integral over the ABC boundary and this is more or less how it works um, and it works sufficiently well so compared on top we have some Neumann boundary conditions we see starting the wave is propagating from the, from the center uh, to the outer region and as soon as the 
we have an we have set the Neumann boundary condition in the model. As soon as the waves hit this Neumann boundary condition, they will totally be reflected, and we see some distortion in the acoustic wave field. Uh, the same is done by setting the absorbing boundary condition on the outer outer boundary. There, we see in the first instance nothing happens because the waves are not traveled until the boundary condition. In the second uh, instance of the of the propagation, it works fairly well because mostly the waves are impinging in normal direction. Uh, and so on and so forth. Uh, just in the last uh, instance of the of the of the solution, where we see already some deviations here from the very spherical symmetry, which indicates that if the waves are not impinging uh, very normally, then we have some issues with the ABC boundary condition. These issues will be addressed by the next. Um, by the next method by the PML. So for for the ABC impinging very in normal direction, the the reflections are not so large, but nevertheless we we have some reflections and these are these are present and these reflections will be mitigated by the the ne next next theory or model uh, which is the PML and the PML is not so costly efficient as the ABC it's more more costly during, during the computation but it yields uh, overall uh, a much better results uh, thank you for watching this video about the ABC and the, the benefits and drawbacks and we will continue with